AMD's FSR 3 finally made it to Cyberpunk Phantom Liberty and the results are insane. Some may argue that this update saved Nvidia 30 series cards and you know what? They are right. I'll be using my 3090 reference card paired with Ryzen 5 5600X on a DDR4 system. This might be actually the cheapest PC to run Cyberpunk in 4K 60fps with max graphics. And voila! So with my system, the FPS is almost doubled with just one setting on. But not only that, compared to Nvidia Super Resolution, the response time is only halved. This is the insane update that finally made Cyberpunk playable in lower systems. And I'm super curious about this. So in our next video, I will be using RTX 2060 from the back of the shelf and to see it if we can run Cyberpunk 4K. Okay, let me show you how we can set it up in a minute. To install, first you have to go to comment section and check for the links and download these two mods from GitHub. After you unzip the files, leave them in a separate folders. Then you have to enable NVIDIA override by double clicking on the registry file on the LSS Civic folder. To finish it, we have to go back to FSR file and copy these two files. Now we should go to Steam, we right clicked on this, we open the game location, we go to bin, x64, then paste the files we just copied. If you have done everything correctly, you should get a message after you launch the game. You have officially doubled your frames in a minute. To make sure the setting is toggled, enable frame regeneration in the settings or you will be mad at me for it not working. Ok, now you should be perfectly set for having double the FPS with lower input lag. Now I'm gonna leave you with the gameplay footage, but make sure to note that this is not pet traced on, but every setting is maxed out. Have fun watching, till next time, Akman out.
Mm-hmm. 